This clip will explain several options you can use to set certain details of issues. ARCHICAD offers the ability to change certain settings about issue details. In the Layout Book tab page of the Navigator, right-click the Layout Book at the top of the Layout Tree and select the Issue Details command from the Context menu. This will take you to the Issues Details dialog. Please note that this command appears only in the Context menu when at least one issue exists in the Layout Book. Alternately, you can activate the Book Settings dialog and display its Issue History panel. In the title row of the current issue, you'll see the Issue Details button as the rightmost button. Clicking it will take you to the Issue Details dialog. In the upper part of the dialog, you'll see the details of the issue, including the ID, name, issue date, and issued by fields. The ID and name fields may be edited in this dialog. In the lower part of the dialog, you can show the Markers field. This field shows which change markers are displayed on layouts. If you select the Latest Revision Only option, only change markers that are part of the latest revision will be displayed on layouts. If you select the All option, all change markers created during the whole lifetime of the project will be displayed on layouts no matter which revision or issue they belong to. If you select the None option, no change markers will be displayed on any of the layouts not even the ones belonging to the latest revision. This will effectively hide all change markers on layouts. Use the last option to define a particular issue as the starting point for displaying change markers on layouts. For example, if you select the Since 01 issue option, which was the first issue, all change markers belonging to any revision after the first issue was closed will be displayed on layouts. Please note that the state of the field does not affect the display of change markers in model viewpoints only on layouts. Model viewpoints will display all change markers. 